The next bit of installation we're gonna do is the trimmer and another resistor. And you notice this trimmer has pretty short leads. So when you put them through, this is a polarized piece. Uh, it does matter, so the negative end is, is toward the center of the board. The screw on the positive side is toward the outside. So uh, I actually can't really, well, I can bend it, so yeah. You want to make sure that it's flush with the board. So uh, make sure you're pushing up on it right lightly while you bend it in so that it'll stay uh, flush with the board. The backs. And then we've got another transistor here. And you remember our friend, the transistor. We've got to take this... Uh, middle wire and do a little uh, friendly shaping to it so that it will fit down in the slots appropriately. Um, I'm going to shape it so that it kind of resembles the top of the resistor or transistor I should say and then it is going into the circuit via slot T4. So we're going to make sure we get all three wires. Reshaped it a little much. T4. Spread, spread, spread. There's a silk screen circle on the wall, on the circuit board Ooh. be careful they will bend easy as you're touching them you don't want to actually pull any leads out of it so there we go we got it on the back you do want to make sure that the transistor is below the top of the trim uh, level which should not be hard to do at all so now that we got that, let's put those in our handy dandy holder here. And away we can go. Again, remember transistors, you can overheat them, so don't don't dilly dally on them. Make sure you've got solder on on the iron and just kind of get it in, not too much, that was a little much. You can actually go alternate and do, while that, let that transistor cool just a little bit, you can alternate over and hit the ones on the trimmer. That way you don't overheat the Transistor gives it just a second to cool. Bada bing, bada bang, bada boom. Those two steps are done. And now we trim. No pun intended with the trimmer.
should be accurately installed and I don't even feel heat up in the transistor really so I think we're we're pretty good on that so there we go